Hello people and welcome! Let's see one of the most amazing softwares used to convert videos developed by DGR Team and called the WinX HD Video Converter Deluxe. If you have problems with the accent used in this video, enable our closed captions clicking on the CC icon in the bottom right corner. WinX Video Converter Deluxe comes with a very simple and easy user interface. On top you have the main toolbar, below the list of videos or slideshows ready to be converted, on the right the main preview and below the big run button. Let's see how this amazing software works. First of all, Let's add some videos we want to convert. Just click on video above and browse for your video file. The first time you do so, WinX asks you all the settings to apply during conversion, also called output profile. On the left of the dialog box, you have all main categories of conversion, from general profiles to profiles for tabs and mobiles, like Apple, Android, Sony, Microsoft and more ones. Plus, you can choose web video profile category if you need to match the best render settings for YouTube and socials. Under common video profile, you have other general formats, in particular for computers. Once you choose the category, select the precise video format on the right. Plus, on the extreme right, you can regulate the ratio between quality and conversion speed. Choose LQ, low quality, to be extremely fast. Otherwise, choose HQ, high quality, if you want to get the best conversion ever in quality. Once the output profile is set, your video appears in the main list. Click on video if you want to add other videos inside. Always share the same output profile just set. On the right, you can use the player and the preview to check the selected video of the list. While playing, you can use the photo button to take a direct snapshot that will be saved in the default Windows folder that you can open clicking on the folder button. At the bottom, you can check the destination folder where all videos converted will be sent. Use Browse to browse for another folder and Open to open the folder directly in case you want to check your output videos. When you are ready to convert, click on Run in the bottom right corner. A new dialog box will show you the conversion in progress. Use the Stop button if you need to block the process. If you have multiple videos in the list, the conversion starts from the first video onwards. If you need to change the output profile for a video, just click on the left button. To edit aspect ratio, resolution and codecs, click on the gear icon on the right instead. On the video added in the list, you can check its original video properties if you need. Below and on the right, you have other important useful buttons. Info gives you all the original video metadata. Edit is used to edit your video through a new dialog box with a big enlarged player on it and important options available below. Under General, you can adjust the video volume. Under Subtitle, you can import and use the subtitles. Inner uses the same subtitles of the original video, while with Extra, you can import a subtitle on your own. Make sure it is in a .srt format. 
Cropping Expand is used to adjust the aspect ratio of the video. If you check Enable Crop, several nodes appear above. You can use this to adjust the active area, which is the one that will be effectively seen after conversion. All the parts outside this area won't be visible and will be simply cut. You can also use the options at the bottom if you need to be more precise. More below, use Auto Expand to match the output profile settings fixed for such video automatically. Use Trim to cut parts of the video you don't like in time. You can click and drag the markers on the timeline or set the timings right below. To apply all your modifications, just click on Done below. You can also edit the video metadata, just click on Rename. On the extreme right, you have other buttons. Use the up and the down arrows to change the order inside the list. Use the bin button to delete such video from the list. If you need to clear all, instead, just click on Clear above. WinX Video Converter has two other interesting features. It can download videos from YouTube and socials and create slideshows with pictures. You can download videos from video hosting sites clicking on URL above. WinX Video Converter is able to download from YouTube, Facebook, Twitter and many others like MetaCafe and Breck. Just paste the link address and analyze it. In the list right below, you will find all possible formats and resolutions you can extract from the video online. Choose one and the video link will be added in the list, ready to be downloaded in the format and the settings you like when you click on Run. Whereas, if you click on Photo, you can select the folder that contains all your photos to create a slideshow. The whole folder content will be added in the list, just as seen for videos. In this case, when you click on Edit, you can check the settings of your slideshow. You can play it with the big player, add or delete pictures from the whole list in the top right corner or even add music more below. The last button in the toolbar, Options, is used to fix the settings of the software, such as language, the output folder, the snapshot folder and the number of course to use. Whenever you need help and information, you can use the free buttons in the top right corner. Use the first one to check license and version of your WinX video converter. Use the second button to contact support if you need. Use the third one to open the online guide. This is all you can do with WinX HD Video Converter by DGRT. This is one of the best softwares you can use to convert videos and download videos online. Don't miss it out!